Now your certified most accurate four zone weather with meteorologist Jeanette Kaye. All right, coming up on 550 on this Tuesday morning. And yes, there is some fog out there this morning. The fog is actually closer to San Antonio and Bear County compared to yesterday. Yesterday, most of it was to the north and east of us. So just give yourself some extra time. Thankfully, it's not terrible. 66 degrees and cloudy with some patchy fog in San Antonio. Visibility at the airport is down to four miles. However, much lower visibility over the western part of the county and over towards Medina County. North along I-35, you may encounter some low clouds and patchy fog around New Braunfels and uh, westbound along I-10. Once you get towards Bernie and back towards Kerrville, you may also encounter some low visibility. Temperatures mostly in the 60s. It is a lot warmer this morning. The air is a lot more saturated. That mugginess, well, that is definitely through the roof. Check out these dew point temperatures. It's going to stay pretty humid all day. However, a big drop in humidity levels tomorrow after a cold front moves through that next cold front arrives tomorrow morning behind it dew points will be dropping into the 20s for tomorrow afternoon comfortable thursday but notice it starts to get more humid over the weekend especially on sunday so notice the cloud cover on the satellite composite you may see some sprinkles or mist on your morning drive especially where the fog is the most dense uh, throughout the afternoon we're not going to see a whole lot of sunshine we'll see a mix of sun and clouds notice those cold fronts out west we'll see the cold front coming through San Antonio tomorrow in the morning. Before it gets here this afternoon will be partly to mostly cloudy highs getting back up into the low and mid 80s here. Some spots to the south and west upper 80s to low 90s. Uh, this time tomorrow we're going to start off with some clouds temperatures in the mid to upper 60s could hit 70 degrees before this front comes through should see the front coming through after 7 a.m. before 10 a.m. Very little to no rain unfortunately with the front behind it. it is going to be cloudy for the rest of the day tomorrow and temperatures will be dropping into the 60s. Bigger cool down tomorrow night into Thursday. You'll be waking up to lows in the 40s on Thursday afternoon highs by then only in the 50s. So cloudy with areas of fog this morning temperatures in the mid to upper 60s until 9 at noon will be closer to the upper 70s with some sun this afternoon. Some peaks of sun forecast high of about 85. I think we'll get that to uh, at about 4 p.m. In the eastern zone, partly sunny 85. The hill country and the western zone, just like yesterday, hotter. 93 in the hill country, about 95 in the western zone. 65 to 70 tomorrow, and then dropping into the 60s, only a 10% rain chance. It gets windy tomorrow morning through the middle of the afternoon. Wind gusts be here between 30 and 40 miles an hour. Thursday, 46 in the morning, 55 in the afternoon. That's jacket weather, 20-30% rain chance. For Friday, it starts to feel more comfortable with temperatures moderating. So we're going to end uh, February with pretty chilly temperatures. And then notice the warmer weather as we go into March. 75 Friday, 81 on Saturday, near 80 on Sunday and Monday. Slight rain chance Sunday, 30% rain chance next Monday. Here's the extended forecast for the western zone, 70s tomorrow, 60s by Thursday. Hill country uh, dropping to 58 tomorrow, 51 Thursday. You can get the extended forecast online at news4sa.com.